God bless you indeed, everybody. The Bible commands us not to be drunk with wine in excess, but be filled with the Spirit. Romans 8, 14 says, As many as are led by the Spirit of God are the sons of God. Amen. So we are commanded to dwell. He who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. So I was just praying. And... um you know, I've had many supernatural encounters, you know, seeing angels, Jesus several times, etc. So just, <clears throat> you know, just on my knees praying and my eyes closed and I, I, I just said, ask the Lord a question. And this figure, all I can explain it. So it was like my spirit, it was like. I'm not talking about imagination. You're imagining something. I'm talking about the minute I closed my eyes, after I asked the question, I was psh, sucked into the spirit like that. And this figure and this being that looked like a taller than a mountain. I didn't see the face. Taller than a mountain. Reached down in such glorious light covering the throne and splendor and picked me up in his hand. But what was funny is that though he picked me up, it's as if I could still see my little legs dangling because this being looked so huge, like a mountain. And then the revelation came to me that the person that picked me up was Father God. So, you know, in the spirit, sometimes you encounter something, then the revelation just flow automatically through the Holy Spirit. Amen. So the being that picked me up in the hands was was Father God. So <clears throat> Father God responded to the question I was asking him by picking me up. And then more revelation came to me that he was expressing his love towards me as his child. So as a child of God, whatever you're encountering today. I want you to understand that Jesus sincerely loves you. You're his child. For those of you who have children as a parent, I believe that you want the best for your children, even to do better than you have done in life. How much more than God, our creator? So I pray in the name of Jesus that the fire of God will come upon you. And you will begin to encounter some powerful supernatural encounters with the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, and even with the holy angels of the living God. God bless you indeed and dwell in the secret place of the Most High.